I've reviewed Bulk's Pure Whey Protein. We've looked at My Protein's Command Energy Drink. Today, we're going to be looking at My Protein's Clear Whey Protein. I have tried Clear Whey Protein before, but these are all new flavours for me, so I'm very excited to try these. The five flavours I have with me today are White Peach, Remune, I think that's how you pronounce it, you may be able to tell me different, Apple, Bitter Lemon, and Tropical Dragon Fruit. And I've also picked up this blue raspberry creatine, so I'm going to give that a try as well. It's worth noting that obviously I won't see the full effects of the creatine because it takes a while to kick in, so it's just purely for the flavour. So if any of you actually watched my bulk review, first of all thank you, and secondly you will understand the layout of this video. I've measured out about half of the recommended amount of protein powder, and around about 150 milliliters of water, which again is about half of the recommended amount. I'm going to shake up all five flavours, show you how they look and how they mix, taste them and then rank them from worst to best. Simple. So without further ado, let's get these mixed up. It's going in my nose. So when you're shaking clear protein, you need to do it for about 10 seconds, let it set for a minute because it does froth up, and then go for it again. Okay, so that's all five mixed up now. I did forget to mention about the nutritional values, so I'm going to put the normal whey protein and the clear whey protein side by side so you can see the differences. And also I did get these on a good discount through one of the MyProtein promo codes, so keep an eye out for those. Okay, so let's get into trying the flavours now, starting off first with white peach. And if you look at that, it's just a slight tinge of pink in there. So first impressions, this drink smells very good, it smells just like white peach. One thing about these clear proteins is that they kind of taste like dry in your mouth when you drink them. You get that? Yeah, I know what you mean, like, it makes your saliva a bit Nice. Like a bit staticky almost, I think it's pretty a decent way to describe it maybe. It literally tastes like peach iced tea or something. I don't know, it's just got like a... I don't really taste for too much, not as sweet. I like, quite like sweet drinks, so it's not super sweet. Anyway, so moving on next to Remun... Remuni? Remune? This one's like a slight... I can't really tell, but it's like slightly blue, creamy. It's a bit of a weird colour. And it smells kind of sour. Like a sherbet, I think. It's kind of like lemony, like just fresh. It just... But it's got the consistency of water, it hasn't got that sort of like thickness. It's like flavoured water. That's actually really good. I like that. I didn't think that was going to be good when I smelled it. It just, it's really quite light. That's one thing about these clear protein as well, that they're so much lighter than a normal pure whey protein. They're far more suitable if you're going to have them at the gym or just before the gym, when you don't want something too heavy. And that one is just like water. Alright, so the next one is apple, and you can see it does clearly look like an apple sort of squash. Or... Boy. <laughs> It smells just like apple chewits. I don't know, I think they're apple chewits anyway. If I can find them, I'll show them on the screen now. But hopefully they taste like it as well. I think it does actually taste like sour apple sweets, but... I think it just tastes like apple squash. I don't know what I think about it though. It's not as strong as I expected. That's a good thing. Yeah, I think I prefer it being a bit like more watery. But the fourth flavour is bitter lemon. And this one smells ridiculously like sour, so... I don't know what this one's going to be like. Oh. I don't really like lemon stuff though, so I don't really know why we got this one. Yeah, I love that. It's a bit strong. It is, I mean, it is a bit of lemon, so I don't know what I expected, but... But if you like, like fresh lemonade, that's what it tastes like. Hmm. Yep, yeah, fair enough. And last but not least, we have Tropical Dragon Fruit. And I really don't know what to think about this one. I'm kind of excited for it, it's something I wouldn't have really tried a flavour of before, so... I think I taste... kind of like jelly. Like a... Um, what's that brand? Mm. Hartley's. Heart yeah, like Hartley's Raspberry. No, I see what you mean. But I don't really, like, love it. You, you know what I mean? I don't really know how to describe it. I don't know. It has got, like, this slight like, tinge of tropical. Okay, so, now it's time for our rankings. I'm going to tell you my ranking, I'm also going to tell you Kate's as well, since she did try them with me. Okay, so my fifth place flavour is Bitter Lemon. I don't necessarily think there's anything really wrong with this flavour, because it does kind of taste like a fresh lemonade, but it's just not my kind of cup of tea. Which flavour do you think was worse for you? What do you mean? First or worst? Worst. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you say you're first at the start? Tropical Dragon Fruit. 
Tropical Dragon Fruit. Tropical Dragon Fruit? Mm -hmm. Any reason? Just not your kind of thing or? It's a bit too sweet, I think. Really? Maybe that's what I like it. So my fourth place flavour is 100% white peach. It doesn't really taste so much and it leaves a pretty disgusting sort of feeling in my mouth afterwards. And I think Kate basically said the same thing as well. So we're in agreement there. I'm going to try it again in the future, 100% obviously, because I bought a whole tub of it. And just try it with different amounts of water, because it may just be a case if it needs a bit more water. And following the theme of the last one, we are again in agreement with our third place, and that is apple. Honestly, there's not a great deal wrong with this apple. I think we both enjoy it more than we would have thought. It's just third place because there's a couple more that we prefer over the apple. But it's something I definitely will be drinking quite often. Okay, so on to our second favourite flavour. For me, without a doubt, it is the tropical dragon fruit. For me, this flavour tastes really good. It's not too sweet, but it's it's like sweet enough for me. As I said earlier, it does really remind me of the Hartley's raspberry jelly. And what was your second flavour? Uh, Remune. Remune? Still, I don't know how to say that. <laughs> Still don't know if that's right. What was wrong or right with this one? That one, like on first sip, is probably my top favourite, but I get sick of like sweet drinks very quickly. So I think I'd get very sick of it after a while because it's very sweet. So on to our favourite final flavour. I've just shut down. <laughs> My favourite flavour was Remune. And the reason for that is because I love sweet stuff. I don't think it's like super sweet, but it's kind of like sweet but sour. It's like I said, it's, like, it's kind of like sherbet. And it doesn't really taste too thick to drink. So I think it's going to be something I can drink all the time pretty much. So if you haven't already worked out what Kate's favourite flavour is. Bitter lemon. <laughs> bitter lemon. The contrast. My least favourite flavour and Kate's favourite flavour. And there's loads of you to drink now if you want. So how come this was your favourite flavour? It's just not too sweet. I feel like it's something I could drink a lot of. But it's I not, know. I don't think it's too sour either though, I think it's a good in between. And as promised at the start of the video, I have the blue raspberry creatine here. They do recommend about 250 milliliters of water, but I always have my creatine literally with a drop of water, mix it together with a spoon, and then just have more normal water after. I just find it's easier to drink it that way. You just have to make sure to stir it really well, otherwise it gets so sandy at the bottom. It smells horrific. I didn't get to taste it then, but it smells. Usually it's like super strong having it with this much water and it's quite like, like sort of sharp, but it's actually really nice. It doesn't really, it doesn't taste like it should be with more water. It's obviously really sweet because it should be with more water, but it, it's actually really good. So the other creatine that I use is mixed berry from Bulk. And like I say, that one's more sort of sour when I have it with this much water. So that about wraps up my review for the five flavors that I've got here today and clear protein overall. I have seen that Bulk have their own clear protein and I would like to see the difference between the two. So I might try that in the future. Let me know if you want to see that. And if you do pick up any clear protein, let me know what you think of it and tell me what flavors you have so I can try those in the future. Thank you very much for watching guys and I'll see you next time.